Hey guys, this is Tyler with Tyler Dragon Tarot, and I just want to say thank you guys for watching, liking, subscribing, commenting. Um, so, I am doing Cancer. I know it's not Halloween, but I really wanted to use my Halloween deck, so hopefully you guys don't mind. So, let's see, what is going on with Cancer? Hopefully good things. Hopefully good things. So... What is going... Well, shoot. You want to talk, don't you? Six of ghosts, okay? Like, this looks very happy and, like, everyone's around, but I kind of just... got. I kind of got the feeling that you're looking at this. Like, you're upset because, like, everyone has someone but you. Um, that message just hit me and like my heart hurt for a second looking at this because it's like everyone's got someone and it's like you're that cat which is weird because i usually view that cat as like a spirit guide but it's like you're all alone and everyone's got someone but you ah, i'm sorry um but you're not alone you got you right At the end of the day, like, dogs and yourself are going to love you the most. <laughs> yeah, oh my god, okay, I'm, I, I'm feeling that reading because, like, you're over here, like, there's people over here with fire burning and you're just here with your stick, no fire on your wand, and you're just like, I got a stick too, and they're like, no, no you don't. And it's like you're trying to pretend to be happy while everyone with everyone else is happy but you're really not you're just like there's no fire and oh you're breaking my heart cancer you really are you're breaking my heart this whole reading is just feeling sad um so let let's see if we can get a positive card or two out of this because i don't like how this is going so far like i don't want to just be like you're sad cancer you're so sad um Oh, this felt right. All right, Cancer, this could be the end of that loneliness. You got the Knight of Imps here rushing in with their passion. So what's up with that? Maybe they're going to light your wand, huh? All right, let's see. Let's see. What else can we get? All right. So tell me about this Knight of Imps. What's going on with this Knight of Imps? Is this a good thing? Is this a bad thing? It's going to be rejected. Oh, I think you're going to accept the offer here. And it's coming together and being really happy. You got your spirit guide flying over saying this is a good thing. Like, it's going to make you feel like you can fly. You're going to feel very connected with this person. It's how I'm taking that with uh, this snake that's just like a dual snake here. Um, intuitively, you're just going to know, like, this is a great person to be with, and you're going to want to move forward with them. And it might move pretty fast here, but just, uh, you know, don't listen to other people, I guess. Just whatever speed you're comfortable driving is... The speed you should drive. I mean, I know there's speed limits posted everywhere, but, you know, whatever. You own this road. So, you know what I mean? So, I feel like this is where you are, or where you are, and this is where it's going. Oh, you can't see that. Um, so, you, you see, like, the loneliness over here, and then happy. It's coming like this part. You got someone coming in and like that horse is running. It's smoke coming out of his nose. They're, they're coming in fast. It's coming, Cancer. It's coming. All right. Anything else we want to say here? Anything else we want to say? Temperance. So just looking at that. So I would just say, like, 
<laughs> Feels like you're creating this, okay? Like, I know temperance is, like, a calming, but, like, you got the witch here, like, making stuff here, like, a spell. Um, and you got your... And it's almost like your spirit guide and you got like someone else's spirit guide looking at each other like what kind of magic is this? Like I feel like this is a this is saying like um, calm down. Calm down. It's in the works. Like you're manifesting this. So manifest away. Like it's the pot's boiling over. Like, this shit's coming in fast. This is what you're manifesting. So, I guess just, you know, I always like to say be careful what you're manifesting. But, it's like I, it's like sometimes when you manifest stuff and it comes true, it comes true in ways that you didn't realize would come true and then you just have to kind of laugh. It's like, well, I guess that comes with what I manifested, but that is what I wanted, so... <laughs> I didn't think about it like that, but that's good. Eight of pumpkins. Okay, yeah, and I feel like that's just saying, like, um, so it feels like a lot of work and, like, you have to put on a smile right now. Um, but put on that smile until it becomes real. Keep going because... <laughs> Keep going. You're right. It's right under the chariot. Keep going because like this night of imps, it's coming in. Okay. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This night of imps, are you? Okay. I kind of feel like this goes with the temperance. Just. Really thinking about what you want because you're creating right now. You're creating. Like, you got two scientific things. Like, it just, you're really creating right now. So, think about what you want. It's like the brain's popping out of the jack-o'-lantern there. Um, use your brain. Like, think about what you want with these passions. Um, because... It has a possibility to give you the Ten of Ghosts, just this everyone dancing, like your happiness is just out there for everyone to see. And the sun, again, happiness, sunflower, <laughs> sunflower, it, that sunflower song just stuck in my head. And it's like, you know, cheesy ass, like in the end, she gets the person she wants. So I don't know, maybe you'll get noticed. <laughs> Because roses can be bitchy or something like that, right? However that went. So. Um, let's draw. I, I actually feel like it should be this deck. Alright, we're going to draw from this deck for an oracle or two. For you guys. Spend time in nature. Heal yourself for this. Because... Um, you don't want to bring your old shit into it. You you don't want to you don't want to be toxic for this because this is has the possibility be, to be a very good thing. So make sure you know yourself. Like you don't want to blame them for past things. It's kind of the vibe I'm getting because you're you're very upset over here, very lonely and all that. Like and it's just like make sure you heal yourself. Talk to somebody you trust here. I just feel like that. Yeah, I'll talk to somebody you trust, but. I feel like this is more saying in this case, make sure you trust the person that you're forming the union with, because there's a, there's a bond in here and it almost looks like a balance here, like they're going to balance you out. So make sure that you're bonding with someone that balances you out. Um. Listen, I heard listen to your heart. So like, don't get, so I'm kind of feel like this is a good warning for you because you're so lonely. There's such a lonely energy on the side of the table that, um, 
you might not see the true night coming. Like, you know what I mean? Like, um, like your true knight in shining armor, just to be a little cheesy. Um, you might end up falling for like a little devil. <laughs> Sorry, there, there's an imp on here, a little trickster instead of the knight. So, and you know that imp, it seems like he's flying a little faster than the a knight. So now that I'm thinking about it, it's like, yeah, make sure you pay attention because that imp might just get to you first. That tri that trickster might get to you first. So just because you're hearing this and say, and there's happiness in your future, doesn't mean you have to fall for the first person that gives you attention because you're you're very lonely at the beginning of this. Um, so sorry to be so blunt, but I feel like you need to hear that. Um, so just pay attention and listen to your uh, intuition because that feels like that's it. Listen to your heart and listen to your intuition there. Make sure you heal because you need it. All right, Cancer, hopefully that resonated. Thank you guys for watching.